scheduled about 52 minutes from now. Great view of the uh, Soyuz MS-09 with its uh, three crew members on board in the descent module, the center section of the three-section Soyuz spacecraft. Just a, a couple of small mid-course correction burns left to go before they begin their fly-around of the International Space Station in about seven minutes. The Soyuz now less than one kilometer away from docking to the Rosviet module on the Earth-facing side of the Russian segment of the International Space Station, currently closing at a rate of two and a half meters per second. Good view of the station uh, as the uh, two vehicles uh, travel in concert with one another, 255 miles above the Earth. And now the Soyuz spacecraft that has performed flawlessly so far since its launch from the Baikonur Cosmodrome in Kazakhstan back on Wednesday. Again, a, a good view from the uh, Soyuz cameras looking uh, at the International Space Station. As you see, uh, the CORE's automated rendezvous system locking on to its target. And again, uh, this view now of the uh, Soyuz from uh, trust cameras on the International Space Station. An outstanding view as the uh, fly around of the station is in progress. The uh, station and the Soyuz are uh, currently flying 255 statute miles over the border between Russia and northwest Kazakhstan. And, uh, the Soyuz now about one-third of the way through its fly around. Everything looking good, according to the Russian flight controllers here in Korolyov. And could you please check? The uh, Soyuz spacecraft is now beginning a roll maneuver that will align its solar rays in the correct uh, orientation on a non-interference basis for its approach for a link up to the Rosviet module, which is just below the uh, crosshairs in this uh, view. Uh, Soyuz uh, currently closing in just about 200 meters away, completing the fly around. Again, this view now is showing a great view, looking right down the barrel of the uh, Rosviet module, and a view of the control panel inside the, the Soyuz spacecraft, where all the commands are, are being automatically issued by onboard computers. Target is uh, approximately half a square to the right and uh, upwards. High over Mongolia, the Soyuz MS-09, minutes away from its link up to the Rosviet module, now just 47 meters away. Closing at a rate of just under two meters per second, everything continuing to go very smoothly. Range 38. Target is moving down by approximately a square. Range minus 0 0.13. Filters are operating. Just 30 meters now separating uh, the Soyuz and the International Space Station. The two uh, craft about to fly into an orbital sunset, moving from northwest to southeast over far eastern Asia. This pass uh, will take uh, both the Soyuz and the station just south of Shanghai, China, into the Philippine Sea. Range 18, rate minus 0 0.11, target is aligned with the center. Crosshair and a good view of uh, final thruster firings 
by the Soyuz as it aligns itself to the Rosviet module on the Earth-facing port of the Russian segment of the International Space Station. Just uh, a few meters now separating the Soyuz from its destination, the target closing at a rate of one-tenth of a meter per second. R range 16, rate minus 0 0.13. Angular size of the target is approximately 1.5 squares. Rate minus 0 0.11. Copy. 0 0.11. The target is offset to the right by approximately one square. Range 10, rate minus 0 0.1, filters are operating, copy. Target With one of uh, the solar rays of the Cygnus uh, spacecraft, uh, also in the field of view, multiple views of the Soyuz as it uh, negotiates the final few meters, we are standing by for contact and capture of the International Space Station. Crosshairs are aligned. Target is at the center range. Five meters. Copy. And please be ready for contact. Angular size is three squares. Three meters is the range. Rate is nominal. We're standing by for contact. Target is at the center of the screen. I confirm contact. Contact confirmed. And I confirm and capture confirmed. At 8.01 a.m. Central Time, 9.01 a.m. Eastern Time, the Soyuz MS-09 delivering a multinational crew to the International Space Station for more than a half year in space, docking occurring over eastern China at an altitude of 255 statute miles. And the docking probe on the Soyuz is now retracting as planned. This will literally pull the two docking interfaces flush against one another to form a hard mate, allowing uh, hooks on the uh, docking interface to close around one another. There's a good view. Soyuz is home after a flawless two-day.